cones, flashing lights, signs. YDOT takes numerous measures to warn drivers of workers and equipment on the road, yet crashes in work zones continue to injure and kill drivers and workers every year. Driver inattention is a common contributor to work zone crashes. At particular risk are YDOT maintenance workers, often engaged in tasks involving short, temporary, and mobile work zones. Our employees in our work trucks are within three or four feet of their vehicle traveling at 75 mile an hour. There's just no room for error. YDOT is currently testing a new sound alert system to warn drivers entering a work zone. These will be sounded off to get the distracted driver's attention so they have enough time left to move over into the safe lane. Designed in-house, based on systems used in other states, the unit is undergoing testing on Interstate 80 near Cheyenne. Right now we got the design down. We're still working out the fine lines and the details and what we want to do with it, with the parameters we want to follow, because the last thing we want to do is make the situation worse out there. Based on testing results, YDOT could deploy sound alert systems full-time on I-80 and in other areas of the state. We're all just trying to come up with all these new safety concepts to have our employees go home safe each night puts the odds back on our side. Reminding you to slow down in work zones and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.